If you're wondering why I'm doing all kinds of yummy Brazilian food today, tomorrow is the Brazilian Festival at Raza Grill, which is down on State Street, about 50, 60 of South State there. And it is a fun event. If you've never been to it, you need to check it out. Brazilian food, entertainment. And so I'm going to show you some delicious Brazilian ideas here. This is a pork loin. I wanted to use up the rest of it that I had. And we're going to actually marinate this in a style that they do in Brazil by taking a a paring knife, you're going to stick it in there, give it a twist so you create holes in the meat. Now you can do this with beef as well. So stick that in there, give that a twist, give that a twist, and then what we're going to do is have the marinade created. And so this is vinegar, olive oil, it has in it some rosemary, basil, oregano, thyme, pepper, salt, and then we're going to add garlic. Now the thing about Brazilian food is all of the garlic that it has in there. So I would think about four or five cloves you would want to add into there to really get some delicious flavor. Now once you get all of that into there, what we're going to do is pour this over the pork here. And now you understand why I made the holes and I kind of have it in a bowl here. What I do after I get it all poured over the pork like this is I'll take it and I'll just kind of push that down in the hole so that marinade is sure to go into the pork loin itself. I'll transfer this to an actual Ziploc bag or a resealable bag and then you can do one of two things. Now in Brazil they do everything in pressure cookers and this is no exception. So I'm actually going to cook this, pan sear it after it's marinated for about an hour or so in, and I'm going to add that marinade in there, in the pan here, pressure cook it for about 45 minutes and then bring it out. Now I've already made some Brazilian rice and beans and cheese bread to go with it. So when we come back, Jim, we'll finish it all up. It's quite a feast today. Brazilian, the word of the day. I love word. it. Word. <laughs> all right. Man, Jim, I wish I got us some of that money <laughs> for the tax refunds. <laughs> hey, if we can't get a refund, maybe we can get something Brazilian instead. I think I got you covered on that one, my friend. So <laughs> here in the kitchen, let's finish up this delicious Brazilian thing in honor of the Brazilian Festival, which is happening tomorrow, June 10th, at Braza Grill, which is approximately about, oh, 60th South State. It's in the parking lot behind it. Fun, food, entertainment. I hope you all try it out. Now, here is the pork loin that's all finished here. I sliced it up, put it on there. You can use beef. You can use a, a shoulder, a pork shoulder if you wanted to. Whatever you want to, any kind of meat, this is a standard style of marinade. Now, I do have Brazilian rice, which, you know, the rice, the beans and that, I do have recipes on the website for it. It's very simple to do. What they do is they actually fry the rice before they add the stock or liquid into it with onions and garlic and always it seemed like when I was in Brazil always had carrots in it and so I added carrots to it cooked them up here delicious yummy and of course the whole kitchen right now smells just like garlic and so that's I remember you could always tell when it was dinner time around Brazil because you would start to smell Oh, so delicious garlic in the air. Black beans here, which have obviously garlic in them. Have some onions in there as well. I'm gonna serve those right to the side here with the rice along with the pork loin there. You can serve your favorite vegetable or salad if you want to on the side. And I made some Brazilian cheese bread to go with it because that is so Brazilian, the cheese bread. There is a recipe for the cheese bread up on cookingwithchefbrian.com's website. You just have to search for it, so it is there as well. Delicious Brazilian marinated pork loin. Go grab the recipe, enjoy some flavors of Brazil tonight on KUTV.com or cookingwithchefbrian.com. Chef, I love your portions. They are large and in charge. Fantastic. Perfect for you, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right.